So let's let's look at today's block. Uh, first, this is it finished, and I looked at that. I looked at that and thought, mm, how does that all go together? But it really comes together pretty simply. So first of all, when you cut your fabric, um, please think about cutting it before you, you know. Measure twice, cut once. <laughs> We, did give, we do give you ample fabric. It, we may not give you ample fabric to do a lot of straightening up. So when you're straightening up, just straighten up as much as you really need to. Um, so we're gonna start with these two strips that you've cut, one of the backing and one of the small print. I'm gonna put them right sides together. So these are cut two and a half inch, as two and a half inch strips. And I'm just going to sew these together. So I do have my machine set up so that I'm using the regular foot here with the setup so it's the needles moved over for the quarter of an inch. I also made my stitch length shorter. I've got it at 2.0 because we're going to be cutting these and putting it together again. Alright. So our iron gave out last month. So we have our new irons. We're always searching for something that is small that you can keep by your sewing machine. I do too, and I like it. Oh, it's because I do a baby piece one. And this one, this one also, you can put steam in, and it comes with this cute little oh, <laughs> container to put the water in. Okay, yeah, so I got one of those for my clients. Yeah, if you can if you can stop from having to get up and down all the time. Okay. But that's circulating your blood. That's why I'm thinking of when I do it. <laughs> I'm moving. That's that's a, another positive thing. So I am without a rotary cutter. <laughs> Okay, so I'm just going to straighten up my end and this is a two and a half inch ruler so I am just going to cut them into two and a half inch strips and hopefully I will get six. I did press this. I always press so that pressing to the darker side because if it's going to show through, you want it so it doesn't show through. One, two, three, four. So then we're going to put these together, opposite colors.
what size are these blocks? Finished? Uh -huh. they, they're, they should measure finished 12 and a half so that once they're in the quilt, they're 12 inches. Okay. No, I messed mine up my first one. <laughs> my first one. Oh, yeah, I was just showing her all this. See, you can see where I ripped it out, where I ripped it out. I think one year we, um, I think there was one year we made smaller blocks. I can't remember. It was a long time. There was also some years she put four or five colors into one block, and I said, Mm -mm. <laughs> I like 12, but then you can break it. You could really break it yeah. down into. It's a, it's a nice size. Yeah. yeah. Okay, two out of three I matched. Not too bad. Okay, so we've got three, four patches. And now we're going to make the half square triangles. So. Cutting these half, half square trials, you're often working with an eighth. If you look, it says cut three, four, and seven eighths out of your white or your light fabric. So we do have, um, this particular ruler is for cutting uh, half square triangles. So the big lines, instead of being an, eight, uh, an inch, they're seven eighths. So you have seven eighths, one and seven eighths, two and seven eighths, three and seven eighths, four and seven eighths. So, um, unfortunately, we just have one of those left. Okay, so for this, for our half square triangles, I'm going to take a light and our dark, put them right sides together. I got here at 8 o'clock this morning, but I still didn't get everything I needed over here. Okay. On the light side, I am going to do a longer wire for this. Draw a line down the center. Those of you that have done this last year, you've seen this. to see that line. Okay. I'm going to put a couple pins just to keep my uh, together. Fran, where do you get the video when you want to go pull up the video? That's an excellent question. It is on our YouTube channel, Fran Sewing Circle. And is there a specific word I could put in to get it? To get this one? No, you'll just have to, I don't know. Um, does she put, does she put like April's block? Okay. It says like it's a year Okay. This will actually be up later today. So I am sewing a quarter of an inch from each side of my marked line. I went backwards and I shouldn't have it. Okay. <laughs> All right. So now I'm going to cut on that line. And again, press it towards the dark side. So one common thing I see teaching all kinds of classes is not getting your fabrics pulled apart so that that seam is all the way open. So I'm just gently pulling that as I go to make sure that that seam is all the way open. All right, and from the magic of Andrea, we have all of our six blocks made. So each, 
each grouping is going to give us uh, two. So we got three sets of that. So then she gets these, you know, my, <clears throat> my issues with this. Okay, let me get my like, you have to see it, right? Okay. Like, okay. Oh All right. We are going to begin to put these together. <laughs> the orange goes to the left. Turn the twist the orange one. Thank you. Didn't even pay attention to that. Put the rows together. This is my first row. Pardon? <laughs> Mine's cutting all the time. Mine's cutting. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna do it through just on the individual ones. Anybody else have any questions, comments about last month or coming up? Or So last month I went to visit my grandbaby and she's got these little scooters that they use now. They just, yeah, you know, everything's the adults push it. Are uh, you pressing those things to the inside or the outside? I am press, I press this one, this row all the way, all down. I'm going to press this row up. I just like to make sure they're going in opposite directions when I don't have to worry too much about the color. So anyways, we're walking around the block and she's scooting, picking up her legs and balancing and uh, I'm running to keep up with her. <laughs> and she told her daddy she was ready for a two wheel bike. <laughs> so her daddy got her a two wheel bike. They went out to the park. It took her 15 minutes to figure out getting started and she was racing around the park. How old is she now? She's three years, oh my nine goodness. months. She's got her balance down. She's got her balance <clears throat> down. She really does. Wow. Yeah. She's on her way. <laughs> no slowing down. Does she look like her father or her mother? Well, her her mother is 100% Japanese, you know, so she looks a lot like her mother. She's got that dark color in her. But neither of her parents were particularly athletic. Okay. I pressed that one down, so I'm going to press this one going up.
Hopefully I don't get any of these twisted. <laughs> Turn it around. No, I meant, I meant like oh, the direction. <laughs> One advantage of taking one off your board at a time. I would have to do that. And I started doing my pins where I want to sew. The sharp part instead of all over the place. Mm -hmm. Little secrets. The more you sew. <laughs> the more you sew, the more you find those secrets. Yep. Are you still repairing machines? Where do you go now? I am only taking in at this point machines that I have sold. Oh, <laughs> I'm one of those. <laughs> There's about an eight week backlog. Okay. So if you're interested, you need to get on the list. Okay. And do you call when we bring it in? Then I, the, yeah, then okay. I email when okay. it's ready for I'll get on the list. Bring Can in. you have more than one? Okay, so I'm just putting a pin <laughs> in at my seams. And just because we are taping this, I am going to put the whole thing together. Two more seams. I am when I look under like that, it's just to make sure that my um, seam is laying in the right direction. Right now, they should be going down, so it's not too much. Alright, quick and easy block. The first one was two. That she starts you off easy. <laughs> oh, I need a boo-boo. <laughs> I told you all, I told you all, I, we really felt we have stocked up, so we have plenty of fabric this time. So the designer of the Strawberry Lemonade has come up with another line that incorporates a lot of the same colors. It's coming out, I think, in October or November. So I also, I've ordered some of that in also. So you are going to have plenty a fabric to finish this off mm -hmm. as you wish. That's great. Mm -hmm. 
So I college. can correct my mm -hmm. first one again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and her next her next uh, one does in, bring in some balloons, a little turquoise. Um, but the greens, the oranges, all those are are the same. One thing Moda is good about that, you can you will notice that the designers Okay, I got one corner off, but not too bad. All right, there you go. Yay, that's pretty. Very 